According to a new Fidelity study, more than three in four parents. Yeah, we've started saving for college, right? I've got one more daughter to get through, but there's inflation. There's rising costs and a lot of anxiety out there. So joining us with more is Tony Durkin, Vice President of 529 College Savings Products at Fidelity Investments. And Tony, welcome to the show. And let's talk more about this study and how the past year has had an impact on parents and families planning for college. Yeah, sure, Mike. Uh, happy to be here. And, you know, the good news is nearly two thirds of parents feel better and, and more po positive than they did at this point last year. Yet, 68% still anticipate some modifications to the uh, traditional in person learning experience. This shows us, as Mike, we've all experienced that the shift to virtual and hybrid um, has created and, and kept this top of mind for all families. And parents are starting to claim that their children are more likely to consider a gap year or online only college uh, if these modifications continue. And what are the top concerns parents and families have when it comes to saving for college? Yeah, the, the concerns have shifted. Uh, there, there's less of a concern about the impact of COVID-19 and more of a concern on the, the impact, as you mentioned early at the outset, uh, inflation in this market volatility that we're experiencing. Also top of mind, Mike, as you probably hear in the news quite a bit, student loan debt um, is a rising concern. The good part, the positive note is 79% of parents agree that student debt motivates them to save for their child's education. While we've had the announcement of the federal student loan debt forgiveness will provide some relief, uh, it still doesn't solve for the larger issue of rising student debt. Any more tips on how to lessen some of the burden or stress some of the parents are feeling throughout this process? Yeah, three tips that can be put into place right now. First and foremost, having a plan. Um, I think all parents would recommend that their, their child when taking a test not plan for that test and simply guess at the answers. Yet 29% of parents are not sure what the college cost will be. The good news, Mike, it's never too early to start saving and using a dedicated account like a 529 account is a great way to take advantage of the tax advantages when saving and paying for college. Second, simply having a discussion with your child about their future education and potential financial responsibilities. Studies have shown just simply having that conversation with your child has led to better saving college savings outcomes. Lastly, one that's overlooked, gifting. Simply asking family and family family members and friends to help save for your child's education. Family members have found that they're more willing to do that and help save for college versus trying to find the next toy or game uh, for the special occasion. Okay. All right. I'm feeling a little better, Tony. I really appreciate the information. And hey, where can folks go for more information on this? Yeah, for free planning tools and tips, Mike, you go to fidelity.com backslash college. All right. Thank you so much for being on our program. And, of course, head to our website, and that's firstcoastliving.net.